Hey hello guys this is Vishnu from Power Stone today I'm going to show you how to root the Eurega mobile I have made this video for the people who are facing such problems in rooting this device we have to download some files to root our device to unlock the bootlog and to install CW recovery mode inside the files I have already downloaded it in my PC here this file I have downloaded it Let's create a another folder and name it as ADB Fast Boot as you are seeing this in this video. Now let's open this zip file and extract all the files in this folder which I have created just now. That is ADB Fast Boot. Now you can see the files has been extracted in this folder. Now let's go back and delete the zip file now copy the recoveries hyphen yu in the adb fast boot mode i have copied this you can see it and let's go back and we should also copy a file called update i slash super su in our micro sd card of our device Here we have copied the file. Let's go back. And now we have to set up the device to recognize our PC so that I have downloaded some Google user drivers to solve this problem. Just download these files. These files help in recognizing our device and it will stop waiting for the device issue. I have downloaded it and copied it in folder. Now let's go to in control panel and click on control panel and type in device and we'll find a option called device manager in the settings. Now click on that and connect your device to the PC and you'll see a option in Android and click right click and click on update driver software and click browse my computer and next click on let's pick from a list then click hard drive let's browse the files and just click on the file which have downloaded the usb drivers and click on android iphone and pin sub open let's click ok now click on android adb in front and let's click next and click yes and now we have successfully installed the drivers of our device and let's go back and now we can now we our system can recognize our device in fast boot mode for that you have to connect the usb cable to our pc and we have to shut down our device completely now connect another end of the usb cable to the device when you connect the usb device there will be a light available red color when you see this red color light, just press volume up button to go into fast food mode. Now my device is in fast food mode. And open the folder and press shift on your keyboard and right click and select open command window here. And I have given this course in the description box. Just copy it. Now copy the first to unlock the bootloader of your Eureka device let's copy it in command mode and press enter and it will wipe all our device data including photos images everything it will format everything in our device except the memory card we will have all files in our memory card so don't worry about your memory card now Let's open the another code to install recovery CWM recovery on your device. I have copied this code. Now let's paste in command mode and press enter and click enter. Now I have successfully installed CWM recovery mode. You can see it on the screen. It's finished. It took around one minute to complete this. Now let's close it and now to disconnect, plug out the USB cable. 
Now we have to press volume of Polando button and we have to press C4 button to open CWMP query. Now we are going to install this super user to root the device. Now it is opening CWMP query mode. Now we have successful game in serial recovery mode. To root our device, we should install Super ECU, which we have been kept in SD card. Now press down button, score and press power button to OK. Now selected install zip file. Now I am choosing choose zip file from SD card, which have been placed the file in SD card. Now press power down button to scroll and press power button to select it now navigate to the update super iso which is present on the screen now press power button to install it and press down s and click ok now you can see it is in this routing our device yes it has been successfully routed our devices now let's go back it's important to select go back and reboot the device which is on the first select it and press ok now choose s fix root and reboot our device and it will reboot our device it will root completely our device i have forwarded this video to save some time i have upgraded apps now you can see my device is totally wiped internal memory now it's on wi-fi so that i can install root checker to show you whether my device is rooted or not now let's you can see the super has been installed Let's go back. Now get. Let's open the super user. Now I click King. No tanks. So I. Open Play Store. Let's. I have a already a. Android ID and password so I'm logging in. I've connected to the Wi-Fi and pressing the password and let's open the Play Store. I'm typing this my ID and password. Finally I have done with the ID. Let's type root checker is available in the play store let's open the root checker and click on the root checker and install this root checker it'll take up will take a couple of seconds to install this root checker now install it let's open it the root checker let's agree press ok now click on verify root to verify root now press grant to confirm now we can see wow it has been rooted successfully